All right, what's up guys? It's your boy Kadimi has a brand new video. Wow, it's been a while. I'm gonna show you guys how to animate 3D characters in Blender. Disclaimer, this is a beginner's tutorial video. So with that all being said, let's go straight into the video. First thing you guys wanna do is there's gonna be a link in the description down below with Fortnite 3D characters. Go ahead and download one. Okay, so as you can see, I have the link right here. Link in the description will be down below. This is where you can download a lot of stuff that's 3D already made in Blender. So go ahead and download a character real fast. You can see they're all in Blender files, which is really great. Shout out to whoever put this together. Okay, so I downloaded it. So now I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. So I'm gonna click on File, Open. Don't save this. Renegade Raider. That's the one that we're gonna open up. So go ahead, click on File, Open, open up your skin, and you should get something like this. So right now we are in Blender. So what you guys want to do is we want to use this skin and animate it. So I'm going to click on the drop down here where we have a collection. You should just see it like this. Click on that collection. You should see Renegade Raider drop down as well too. And you should see these are the bones that make the actual skin instead of just a normal T-pose. Um, this is what the bones are kind of where we're at. So we're going to go ahead and delete those real quick. So click on it, right click, delete. And now we deleted the bones. And now that we did that, let's cl click on file export export as fbx and we can name this no structure uh no structure renegade once you guys go ahead and export that let's go ahead and open up mixmo and i'll show you guys where to go from there so now that you guys are on mixmo as you can see i have a random character loaded up with a whole bunch of animations so if i want to use like the tunt animation it does that for you automatically which is kind of nice um so yeah that is pretty much what that is but the issue is that we want to upload our own character here and the way we do that is by here clicking pause on this real fast click on upload character select character file and then we're going to click on that fbx that we recreated it was the no structure renegade uh fbx i'm gonna click on that it's gonna go ahead and upload it and now if you can see it uploaded the skin so now we're gonna go ahead and rig it real quick so the chin we're gonna drag it over to the chin the wrist drag it over to the wrist the elbows over to the elbows the knees to the knees yada 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 the groin to the groin right about there and then click on next. Now it's going to go ahead and auto rig it for us. We don't have to do anything ourselves. Again, like I said, this is like the most basic way of doing it. It's probably an outdated version of doing it now. I'm sure there's a better way of doing it, but this is the way that I've learned to do it. If you're still using Meximo, it rigged us our character. So now it moves and now it's come to life. Let's click on next into our um, timeline here or our whatever page and just click next, whatever, whatever. Yada, yada, yada. Now it's gonna go ahead and load it up. And yeah, look at her. Her skin's all messed up, but it's all good. Doesn't really matter. Uh, all that matters is that we have her in the game. And now we can do like a cool animation. I don't know, we can click on something here um, where she's just kind of just chilling and sitting down. So as you can see, we have the character fully uh, moving as well too. So now that we did this, let's click on download and make sure it says FBX. I'll put mine's at 60 frames per second. And yeah, FBX with skin, that's fine. Download it real fast. And the download has been now completed. So now we're gonna go ahead and go back to Blender and import this new skin. We're gonna click on File, Import, FBX. Sitting and Laughing is what it was saved at. So sitting and laughing.fbx, let's click on Import FBX. And now you can see we have two characters and that's kind of sus. Hey, yo, what? Hey, yo, what the fuck? But anyways, yeah. So now we have two characters, one that's animated and one that's not animated. So what we're going to do at this point is save the textures from this one over here over to this one because right now this one has no textures. So we're going to go ahead and do that right now. So what we're going to do is click on the character itself. Go to the amateur, which is right here. Drop down, click on that. Click on the head. And now click on this down here. This is like this little circle here where you can do the textures at. Click on here. And then from there, so you can see it says Sarah Hair 01. We're gonna look for another one that says Hair, uh, Sarah Hair 01 uh, with an actual texture. As you can see, this one just has no texture. This one has a texture. So we're gonna click on that. And you can see it should be adding the eyes in now. So you can see the eyes are being added in. Let's click on the next one, zero Sarah Head. Um, and then click on this again, browse materials. So this one that says Commando 01. We just follow the one up top, Commando 1, boom. It's already editing it in. So now let's go to the other one. Again, repeat the process. So now we have two skins, both textured. We can get rid of this one now. It doesn't really matter that we have her here anymore. So I'm gonna highlight all of these. I'm gonna shift and click all of these. Right click, I'm gonna click on delete. And now she's gone and we have her specifically. So now we have like these weird 
looking things on top of her head. These are the bones of the actual character. So what we're gonna do is click on these and go ahead and just disable them, their view. So we hide in viewport, hide in the render as well too. So then now when we click on the space bar, it should be rendering out. As you can see, it's very blurry because I have it that way because I don't want my computer to crash while I show you guys this. She is fully animated and rendered. And obviously your final character will not look like this because I don't have no lighting, no no environment yet, which could be its own separate tutorial if you guys want it to be. If this video gets at least 500 likes, I'll definitely do that. But yeah, as you can see, we do have a textured and animated character and i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did leave a like comment down below and we just want to see you next on the channel and once again thank you guys so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys later peace